evening friends my name is akash in this video we are going to learn how to use auto filter through vb coding let's see these are the data I want to use auto filter on account type. How can we do that? Our range is A1 to F1. A1 to F1. Dot auto filter. Here we need to give the field. Is our this is field one this is field one. I will give the criteria name equal to dot input box On type, I will just run this code. You can see here filter is automatic created. I will just Assign this macro on a save button. Assign this. Macro. Then I will run here. Then I will give the name. That is created on account type CD. Now I want to use multiples filter. How can we do that? Let's. One dot range A one to F one auto filter field equal to I will Give the field name in array. I'll say num two three. Like, yeah, two and four. I'll give the name two and four. Right area one equal to you can simply give here in double quotes, but I Give the with the input box. Input box on type. Now here we will operator. Excel or Excel or operator is used for multiple criteria. Here I will give the criteria to input 
इंटर ब्रांच नेम I will just assign this macro on a button. I will click here and I will give the name auto filter two. Just click, right click, and assign macro auto filter two. I I just click here enter account type I will use the account type I R A here branch name I will be waste side you can see here multiple filters has been created on the sheet. You can use application or auto filter. Mode equal to false. Auto filter mode equal to false to clear the filter. How can you do that? I will just run this code. can see here all the filter has been cleared I will just comment here this code now I will make a small project using auto filter how can we do that I will declare a one more variable WKPH workbook the worksheet whatever you have required I will declare a workbook I will just copy the entire code and paste it here One dot range a one dot special sales current region sorry dot special sales special ibc one dot copy. I want to first of all. I will do that. I will filter whichever uh, our requirement. I will filter and copy the filter data in another workbook. You can I have <coughs> comment here. I will see it here. See WKB equal to workbook. I will paste the data, visible data in workbook. So I will write the code WKB dot seats one dot range.
Yes. I gave here applicate. Function dot cut copy mode. Let's see, I will assign this macro on a sheet. Give the name here. Project. Project. Just right click and assign macro. Auto filter project. I will just click click here. Yeah, you can see here. I'll do F8, F8. You can say account type. I want account type here. I will R V. I will give the branch name central. Then you can see. I want to copy this data, filter data. And paste it into a another workbook. I will go here. Then you can see here a blank workbook has been opened. You can see here. I'll just zoom it. And I will just click here. Then you can see here all the data has been pasted in another workbook. Here application dot cut copy mode. Why cut copy mode? <coughs> The, you can see here the dancing bar the dancing these are used to remove the dancing bar you can see here all the dancing bar has been removed and this is the sit one dot auto filter mode is, is used to clear the filter in sit one auto filter hour you can see here all the filter has been cleared and our requirement data has been pasted in another workbook you can see here we have given the criteria account type ira and branch center thank you guys for in this video you have learned how to use auto filter with single criteria and how to use auto filter with multiple criteria and we have created a, a small project with auto filter If you like this video, please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel to get more updates. Thank you guys. Bye bye. Take care.